my channel if you are new here. Hi, my name is Gummy or Rin. Don't forget to like and subscribe and join the Gummy Gang. <laughs> so today we have another special video haul from Sheen. And this time, come a little closer. This time it is actually kitchen goodies. Random ass kitchen things that I found on Sheen. That I was like, oh, what? I'm totally gonna get that. <laughs> so yeah, we're going to go for kitchen goodies today. Oh, hey Jinx. My cat has decided to join in on the kitchen fun too. Let's get started. So we're starting off with something very cute and basic. God, it's these cute little oven mitts. Is that a mushroom? I think it's supposed to be a cactus. I think it's a cactus. Okie dokie, so here they are. If you guys don't know, I'm planning on moving into my own place sometime next year. So I got all these little goodies and stuff for my new kitchen. And my kitchen is obviously going to be pink and white because, like, why not? <laughs> so I got these cute little oven mitts. Look how cute they are. Don't you just love cactus? Cacti? Cactuses? Looks like a mushroom. But it's a cactus, I promise you. It's a cactus. Can I bake you some cookies, you know? Funny enough, I actually did get some cookie cutters. <laughs> Number one of the cookie cutters, I have to tell you. They're freaking cute. Okay, you can't really see them through here. Let me get them out. Can you see them? You can hardly see them at all. Okay, so there's one, two, three, four. There's four different size cookie cutters. One, two, three, four, five actually. Okay, damn. There's like one, two, three, four. Okay, I can't count properly. I'm sorry. But there's different cookie cutter sizes. And they're little doggy bones. Isn't that adorable? Like, I can make cookies in the shape of little doggy bones. It is so freaking adorable. They're kind of stuck in each other, though. But, like, look at them. They're so cute. I cannot wait to cook with these. I've been wanting some normal cookie cutters for so long. But the only ones we have is freaking Christmas trees and hearts. That is so boring. So I got these cute little doggy bones. And I cannot wait to use them. They're actually pretty good quality, might I say. Like... They're pretty, like, flexible, but not too flexible that they would break, practically. So, yeah. Ooh. Oh, damn. Oh, damn. Oh, damn. I want, I want to keep them together. There we go. So, for these and for the oven mitts, I would say a 10 out of 10. Okay, I have a few more little cookie cutters because I, I really wanted some cookie cutters. And there are some cute things there, you know. There was really cute things. Like this little candy. You can't really see it. Open sesame, man. There we go. It's a candy-shaped little cookie cutter. Look at it. Sounds pretty solid to me. Kind of feels very sharp that you could like cut yourself with it. Actually, that's. I don't know if that's good or bad because you kind of need to cut the dough anyway. But I cannot wait to use it. It's a little candy. Ooh. And another one to go with my. Cactus heaven mitts. I got a cactus cookie cutter. <laughs> like, why not? It's a cactus. Like, I don't know why I just have things for cactuses. They're just so cute. Like, I don't know what makes a cactus cute, but it's adorable. Look! Look at it. Look at it. It's just so cute. I cannot wait to use this. Like these and the doggy bones. Looks like a ghost now. Look at it. But these and the doggy bones, I cannot wait to use them. Because it's a cactus. Oh, cactus is so cute. Cacti? Cac cactuses? Cacti? Okay, I know this is really, really random. But I got a pizza cutter. Yeah, I kind of, um, <laughs> I got a, a pizza cutter, you know. Ooh. Sounds pretty not solid, actually. Not at all. <laughs> it, like, it wobbles really easy. It's very, um, loose. Maybe I can tighten it up. No, Connor. No, okay, sadly not. 
But it's still a cookie, and not a cookie cutter. It's a pizza cutter. Yeah, so you like have a pizza, like, I don't know um, if you guys make your own pizzas at home, but we like to do that here. So we make the pizza, and when it's out of the oven, you take this baby, and you run it through it. So, yeah. Okay, so this is just like, I know this is weird. This is pretty weird. But, um... I got a bamboo spatula. <laughs> it's just like a normal bamboo wooden spatula. It smells like normal wood, so yeah, it's like a normal bamboo spatula. Will it give me any... What's it called? Those little things that pierce your skin? Splinter, yeah. I don't know. I don't know if it'll give you any splinters. I hope not. Um, I'm going to have to wash this a few times before I use it. Because there's a lot of um, residue on it. So, yeah. But it's actually just a bamboo spatula for my pots and pans. Because I don't want to use metal on my pots and pans. Because then it ruins the nonstick on them. So I just decided to... Bada boom, bada bam. Yeah, one of these babies. Okay, I don't know if this is going to get weirder than the spatula, but um, I like to drink a lot of boba, and I make my own boba, okay? This is this is going somewhere, don't worry. I, um, I make my own boba, and like I have a lot of straws and stuff that I practically reuse and stuff. So I got this. <laughs> I got these little um, straw cleaners. Like, you practically, you just take this one. Let me get my straw real quick. Okay, so if you want to clean the straw, you just pick out which size would be the best one. I don't know, maybe this one? No, it's too small. Let's say, go with, that's a really big one, oh my god. Um, let's go with this one over here. And then you put it inside the straw. And it cleans it inside. Oh, I thought it got stuck. <laughs> so, yeah, that's, that's, I don't know. Um, I think I was just joking around, oopsie, when I decided to buy this. But it can come in handy. And there's so many different sizes of them. Like, you know, you always need one summer other time. You're going to regret not getting it. So I was just like, what the heck? You know, it's like one dollar, so I may as well just get it. So yeah, I got, I got some. <laughs> Okie dokie, number next. We have ice cream sticks. But there's more. They're so cute. It's like a little popsicle maker. You like, you fill these little um, molds up and it's like a pull print. And then you take these little lollipop sticks or uh, ice cream, ice lolly sticks, and you put them inside here. So when they're frozen, you take them out and you have a paw-shaped little ice lolly. Isn't that just so cute? I thought it was so freaking adorable. So I just, I had to get it. It was, it's so cute. <laughs> Should I try this maybe? Like, should I randomly try this? I don't know. Should I randomly try this on a stream or something? Maybe I should. <laughs> okay, I think I just got a lot of weird random stuff on there. And this is... I don't know if this is random, weird, or really smart. Because it looks pretty normal. I don't know if you wouldn't call this normal. But yeah, and then you pop it out. See? And... Ba, 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 ba. It's a funnel. It's a freaking funnel. <laughs> and when you're done with it, you just pop it back up and you won't have it sitting in your um, cupboard using so much freaking space and you never actually use it. So it's literally just a rubber funnel that you can just put in your cupboard like that. Bada beam, bada boom. And then when you need it again, you just pull it out. Not in that way, though. There we go. You just pull it out, and there's your funnel. I thought this was genius. Like, we have three funnels 
um, at the moment, and I hate them. I absolutely hate them because they take up so much space in the drawer. So I was like, when I get myself a funnel, I'm going to be smart about it and get to a retractable funnel. Ooh. <laughs> so yeah, you might think it's weird, but I think it's pretty, it's pretty dope. I would, I would say that if anything in this whole hole, you should get this one, you know, this one. You should get this one, because it's, it's just, it makes sense, okay. <laughs> Okie dokie, number next. I'm not going to take these out of the packet, I'm just going to explain to you what it is, if you cannot really see. No, it's not a strawberry flavored Kit Kat, unfortunately not. It is actually clips. They are little pegs for your um, potato chip bags or... I don't know whatever you want to use it for, you can use it for that. Let me take one out. I'm curious. <laughs> I'm pretty curious. Let me take out my Kit Kat. Okay. Where do you... Oh. Ah, yeah. Okay. So it's a little clip. You open it up. See now this is the bag of potato chips that you want to close. You just do that. And you clip it in, and boom, your bag is closed. So I was like, that's pretty cool. I'm going to get me that too, because play smart, not hard. You know what I mean? So yeah, I got four of these. I can't wait to use it. Now I can keep all my snacks in my room and not worry about any bugs getting into them, you know? <laughs> so yeah. <laughs> Okay, now we have, I think this is the last cookie cutter that I actually got. Ooh, let me put that down. This is a cute, freaking adorable little kitty. Can't open the bag. <laughs> okay, so it's a little kitty cat cookie cutter. It's a, it's a kitty. <laughs> it's a kitty. This one feels much more good quality than the other ones but i don't know this is weird but it's it's a kitty cat it's a jinx now i can make jinx cookies i love it it's so cute <laughs> so yeah okay we are coming to nearly the end of the video and this is the next item i got okay i can't really take it out the packet but you can see what it is right here it is a pink mini whisk so it's just like a hand whisk, chaka 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 da, and your eggs are done, or I don't know, your cake batter or something. You just whisk it up. So yeah, I got a cute little pink whisk. Okay, another one for one of the molds I got is this um, ice cube. Would you call it an ice cube? Ice sphere? Ice circle? Ice bowl? <laughs> Like, you put, there's like little holes in the top here, and you just take, I don't know how you're going to do this. Do you need to use an injection to inject the water into it the whole time? That's going to be quite annoying. Uh. <laughs> but, um, if I get it done somehow correctly, you just need to like put water in the top of these little holes over here, and then it fills it up in a little sphere, and you put it in the freezer, and when you take it out, it'll be a bowl of ice. Like an ice cube, but a circle. <laughs> like a sphere, I guess, like a bowl. So, yeah, I thought it was pretty cute. I didn't think of the efforts I would have to put in to actually get these into the freezer, I'm not gonna lie. Because I wasn't really thinking of, like, I'm gonna have to do that to each and every one of these little... So at least I will I will have a lot of patience after I'm done with all of this. I'll either be a freaking amazing at my patience or I would just I probably I don't know, maybe just throw the whole thing away and be like screw it. <laughs> so yeah, this is going to be interesting to see. And then the last thing for today's kitchen haul is a pink cutting board. Yay! <laughs> it's a tiny little cutting board. Chop, chopping board. I don't know what you guys call it, but this is a cutting board for me, I, I believe. Yeah. Uh, yeah, it just says kitchen on the, on the label at the back here. But yeah, it's a plastic pink little cutting board for when you're cutting your meat or your vegetables or 
whatever you want to cut, I guess. So yeah, and it's so cute. I wish it was a little bit bigger though, I'm not gonna lie. Because when I cut, I use big knives, you know? Like, my knife would cover this whole point. Um, and it's pretty small. And I, I, I do tend to mess a lot when I'm cooking. So I would prefer it to be a bit bigger. But, mm, you know, it's not that bad. It's pretty cute though. It's, it's pink. That's what cares. That, ooh, that's what cares. That's what matters. So, yeah. <laughs> So that is the end of today's Kitchen Hole Sheen Random Items um, haul, I guess. And I'm, I'm pretty happy with everything, actually. I don't think there's actually anything in this haul that I was unsatisfied with, except for the, the ice bowls that I didn't think of beforehand. <laughs> with refilling them but other than that i'm pretty happy with everything that i got in today's haul and i cannot wait to actually use them when i eventually do move into my new house and my new kitchen and stuff so yeah <laughs> i hope you guys enjoyed this video and if you did please don't forget to leave a big thumbs up and if you have not already please subscribe and join the gummy gang and i'll see you guys in next week's video i hope you have an amazing week stay safe stay cool I love you. <laughs> Johnny! <laughs>